Kissing in the front of my car Under the stars I want you to know I'll take this love slow Hi guys, it's Nicole and welcome back to my channel. Today's video is the long-awaited house tour. You guys have been suggesting this ever since we moved in, but it's been a little over a year since we got this place. A lot has happened, but we're pretty much settled in. We still want to do a few more things to the house, but I didn't want to keep postponing this video, so I'm super excited to show you guys our house. But before we get into it, I want to thank Canon for sponsoring this video. Canon has been helping me capture content literally since day one. I started my channel using Canon cameras and I don't plan on stopping. Today, I'm going to be talking about the Canon EOS M50 Mark II camera. This is the main one that I use in my videos and today it's going to help capture the house tour. The EOS M50 Mark II is the perfect camera for creators of all kinds looking to take their photography and videography to the next level. And the EOS M50 Mark II content creator kit is currently $100 off until November 29th, so click the link down below to get yours. The very angle touchscreen LCD that flips out makes it great for vlogging on the go. You can also shoot videos in vertical video mode on this camera, which is great for when you need to post videos on to social media. The camera has built-in Wi-Fi and Bluetooth technology so you can upload your photos and videos to social media in real time. Also provided in the EOS M50 Mark II content creator kit is the lightweight Canon tripod grip, which is great for vlogging, and a detachable Bluetooth remote so you can operate the camera from a distance. Click the link down below to get your Canon EOS M50 Mark II content creator kit now. I'm so grateful to work with Canon and to continue to capture all of these milestones in my life. Thanks again to them for partnering with me on this video, and now let's get into the house tour. Welcome. <laughs> Welcome to the house tour. Come inside. I'm just gonna take you guys throughout the whole house and all the different rooms just to give you like a teeny overview. Um, to the left is a living room. Back there goes to the kitchen and access to the backyard. To the right is my brother's room, the pool room, and then more access to the backyard. And then upstairs is my room and my parents' room. But first, we're gonna go over here. I'm gonna set you down. This is what we call the movie room because as you can see, there's a TV right there and then all of our couches. So we just love spending time in here and especially love watching movies. So right here, we have this little like table thing with some flowers and a nice painting. And then on this side, we have a piano. Over here is the piano that Christian plays a lot. We have some lamps on top and then this circle mirror right there. And then we have our lovely couches. These are the love sack couches that we have. They're super comfy. When we first moved in, my parents didn't have their bed because we were still selling our old house at the time. So they slept on these couches for the first few weeks that we were in this house. They're that comfy. We have them laid out like this, but you can actually move them around like however you want. So each of the couch pieces, you can like move them. And this is like, I don't know, probably our 10th time moving them around. But this is how we have them laid out right now. Um, they're in like two little pods. And then over here, we have one of our love sack bean bags. So we have two in total, but my brother has the other one in his room. But these are also like the comfiest things ever. <laughs> and there's like blankets and I don't know, I just love these so much. But when you go over here, we have this like ladder rack of fluffy blankets. Whenever we watch a movie, we just grab one from the rack, go onto the couch and watch a movie. Okay, over here we have one of these, um, what are these called? Side tables. Side tables. There's one on each side of the TV. But on this one, we have a popcorn maker. Down there is just like storage. I think we have like our Nintendo Switch stuff. And then this goes to the TV area. So we have a very nice fireplace going on <laughs> and the actual fireplace down there. But we have some plants. And then this bad boy right here is our karaoke machine. So another thing we do when we hang out in this room do karaoke it's very fun and then last part of this room again is just the other night table stand i don't even know <laughs> um down there is like board games and then we have some books a lamp oh my gosh i never mentioned the picture frames we have four of these in total two on this side two on that side and all of them are pictures of sadie so if you want to come close and see our very cute dog we have this picture right here this is a picture of her in our kitchen area and then that is her sleeping on the bean bag. And then the ones over here, <laughs> this is our favorite. She's wearing like a boba bandana and her eyes look like boba too. And then that one on the top is another one of her sleeping in the bean bag. And that's everything in this room. So come follow me and we're gonna go to the kitchen next. So you can either access these rooms through this door or like that <laughs> if you walk down there, but we're gonna walk through 
over here. This area is for adults. I don't really go over here. But fun fact, before we moved in, this used to be a laundry area. So it had like a washing machine, but we had that taken out and put more cabinets and like this countertop so that we could just have more space. Over here is our fridge. I'll show you this one. We have our drinks over here. There's like Diet Coke, LaCroix, of course, my chocolate milks. And then down here is our freezer. And we keep our frozen foods, mini cord dogs, and then our ice cream. So we have Hagen Dawes, drumsticks, mini ice cream sandwiches over there. Got my Eggo waffles. Then we have the rest of the kitchen. Over here is like an island. We have our stove. And then on that side, <laughs> on that side are like four <clears throat> stools so that people can eat. It's like a little breakfast. breakfast. Yeah. Like a breakfast nook? Bre no. Is that what you're Breakfast bar, breakfast nook. Yeah. Not sure. Oh. Right there, we have a little sign that says, be kind, be thoughtful, but most of all, be thankful. <laughs> okay, and then over here, more cabinets and more snacks. So we have our jars right here. My mom keeps these stocked 24 seven. Let's see, what do we have? We have Milano cookies, granola bars, fruit snacks, candy, and Slim Jims. And then in this right here, more snacks. Wow, it's like heaven in here. But we have some wafers, Rice Krispie treats, candy, and then this one <laughs> we have like cereal hot chocolate stuff and chips it's a very good time at the Lano kitchen <laughs> and then we go over here here these are the stools that i'm talking about like they pull out like this and sit here at the back snack <laughs> over here is our dining table i'm gonna go turn these lights on over because okay. i think it looks really pretty i just think those lights are really pretty so i want to show those on for you but this is our dining table um we have some nice flowers and some candles and then over here is my mom's laptop. This is where my mom works every single day. I don't think a lot of people know this, but my mom is my manager and she has been since day one. So everything that happens like behind the scenes, my mom takes care of. This is where she does her emails. And then this dining table area is also where I spend a lot of my time with her when we have like Zoom meetings or when we just have to take care of a bunch of our work. So yeah, this is where my mom works every single day. And this is her beloved laptop that a lot of stuff goes on there. <laughs> oh yeah, and then obviously we use this table to eat family dinners and stuff. And then over here is our other living room. I just love like how many people can hang out. Like we can have people in the kitchen, making food at the breakfast nook, also people here at the dining table, and then also these couches right here. So these are from Target? Mm -hmm. Yeah. And this was actually one of the first rooms that my mom decorated. She kind of had this like blue and tan beige theme going on. We have a very nice fireplace, another one, and all the paintings. See, like everything matches. Everything looks great. And then over here is Sadie's area. So this is where her bed is and all of her toys. She has a lot. And then also her food and water. And then we have this little like dog bone that says, I love Sadie. It's super cute. But yeah, this is where she plays. She doesn't sleep here though. Even though her bed is here, she sleeps with my parents. That's like one of 10 napping places. Yeah. Okay, and that is the finish um, living room, kitchen area. Now, let's go into the backyard. One of my favorite places in the house. I don't know if you guys remember, but when we first moved in here, we did not have a pool. It was just a huge patch of grass. I'll try to find a clip right now and put it in, but like, I feel like the change of our backyard is just, it was so huge, so. Now let me show you guys what it looks like outside. <laughs> Welcome to our backyard. This is our pool area. We have a bunch of furniture. Come over here. <laughs> we have these beach lounge chairs. Just go like this. You can also adjust like how far you lay back, but these are super comfy. It's actually a very nice day out. Like I would spend <laughs> some time here. Over here is more seating and it's under this thing called a pergola that my dad actually built. It's like this wooden thing and then we put a tarp on top as well as some lights. So it's just like a very nice area shaded and all of these chairs are surrounding a fire pit so this table right here with these like blue rocks you can turn on a fire and it's so nice whenever i have friends over we usually like make s'mores over here and then over here it's our pool and a cool thing is we can actually control like the heating all of the lighting on an app on our phone this is our basketball hoop it's from amazon it comes with four little basketballs but we play with this all the time when we're in the pool and then i don't know if you can see but there's like a step right here it goes along this whole side of the pool so you can like sit it's very nice and then over there are some floaties we have a flamingo donut llama super fun this is called the baja step so you can like put chairs right here and sit you can also a hole for like the umbrella but on the Baja step, we have some turtles. In total, we have five turtles in the pool, but like in the ground, there's four. So that's me. Over there's my mom. <laughs> 
down there is Christian, and then the furthest one going towards the deep end is my dad. And then lastly, Ooh. there's Sadie, <laughs> the little thermometer right there. It's also a turtle. So we have some turtles placed around the pool just for each member of the family. I think they're so cute. And then over here is the hot tub. It's pretty big. You can fit like 20 people in here. I love going in here after like dance practice. And then over here we have our two day beds. So these are probably my favorite furniture outside. You just lay here and it's so comfy. Like I could literally take a nap, um, but we have two and we usually put like an umbrella right here if it's like super sunny. So then you just like chill out. Last furniture out here are our picnic tables. So whenever we have people over and we're hanging out in the backyard, we usually take out all the food and put it here and this is where we eat. So we have two in total, but that's the whole backyard. Back into the house. So over here, this is our pool room. And fun fact, this used to be a window and not a door, but we wanted to have another place to get to the backyard. So not only can you enter from that area like the kitchen, but we have our pool room. And my mom wanted me to add that the purpose of the pool room is that when you're wet from like the pool, you don't go through the kitchen and get like that part of the house wet. So we have this room and also it's closer to the downstairs bathroom. So come inside. <laughs> All right, so special guest appearance. <laughs> mom Hello, guys. dad. This is where my dad works. This is his office space. Yeah. He has his desk and his computer. You put me in a little corner of here. <laughs> Enjoy the fire. <laughs> nice yeah. and warm. Oh, look at that. Another fire on the TV. And it's pretty cool because when you're in the hot tub, you can also look into this room and see the TV. But under we have a sign that says good vibes only. It lights up. You can like turn it on and off like that. We have a chair right here. And then also some Sunbum products. Shout out to Sunbum. And then down here we have towels so that when people come out of the pool, we'd be like, there's a towel. Over here, probably my favorite part of this room is our mini fridge. This is our drink fridge and when people come over, they raid the whole thing. But like the kitchen, my mom keeps this stock 24 seven. And let's see what we have in here today. We have some Capri Suns, water, Starbucks fraps, more chocolate milk, and then like soda down there. And then last part of this room that I wanna talk about is this okay so we have um a closet right here that we keep storage but we also have pink curtains if you guys have been watching me for a while and you remember at the old house i used to have these pink curtains in my room and just to clear up some confusion because i think some people think i'm in the old house because sometimes i film in front of these pink curtains and they're like oh my gosh she went to her old house and filmed with the pink curtain but no we just bought the same exact ones and then put it in this house so then whenever i want to film in front of them i just go to this room and film so yeah, those are the pink curtains. And that's this room. Through this doorway, we have this little like... Mosquito net. Magnet. Oh, is that what it's magnetic called? Magnetic mosquito net or something. Magnetic mosquito net. And it's basically, since we have that door open all the time, we just didn't want bugs inside. So we put this here. It goes like that. <laughs> here, go inside. <laughs> Over here is the downstairs bathroom, and this is the bathroom that my brother and my dad uses. And then if we have guests over, they use this bathroom as well. But like, I don't know, you guys want to come It's not much to it. It just looks like this countertop shower. Here, I'll read this for you guys. Be thankful, happy, kind, helpful, imaginative, friendly, wise, adventurous, trusting, caring, funny, patient, and forgiving. And creative. We have this closet right here, just like extra storage, and then some cabinets with like towels, sheets, random stuff like that. Okay, and then this door is my brother's room. He's not here right now, I think he's at, where is he? He's uh, at his friend's house. They're getting ready for Friendsgiving. Oh, right, but this is his room. Um, like I mentioned earlier, second love sack. His room used to be white, but if you can't tell, his favorite color is dark blue. So we painted the walls dark blue, sheets are dark blue, and then also, if you didn't know, he's a musician, so his room is filled with a bunch of instruments. He has a drum set, a guitar over there, he has a tapestry on the wall with like a music note, and then over there he has an electric guitar. And then he also has his like gaming setup with his computers and a TV up there. Oh right, I forgot. There's a keyboard as well. So he plays the piano in the living room, but then also that over there. And that's my brother's room. So now we go back up here and we're back where we started. So yeah, that's like the layout of the downstairs. You can just go around and that's, that's everything. But now I'm gonna take you guys upstairs. This is our little staircase. At our old house, we had like a lot of stairs compared to this house. Right here is a closet, and this is what I use to put all of my jackets in. It gets kind of crazy in here, not gonna lie. Like we try to clean it out pretty frequently, but then it gets crazy again. But I keep all of like my hoodies, my fluffy jackets. We also use it for storage, like shoes and boxes and whatnot. Okay, and then we go up a few 
few more stairs. And now this hallway leads down to my parents' room. But then this door is my room, which I think will go to last. But in this hallway, we have like cabinets and more storage stuff for like pillows, blankets, all that stuff. And then we come into my parents' room. Okay, so disclaimer, this is the last room to be decorated and my parents are still adding stuff. For example, there's curtain rods without curtains, so they're like still putting together their room. But this is what my parents' room looks like. Um, they have this huge mirror and huge closet. So, yeah, it looks like that. And then this is their bed. It's so big, it's so comfy. I love laying in it. And then they have two nice stands on each side of the bed with those lamps and they're super pretty. Oh, and they also match this little like chair plush thingy. What, what do you call that? Poof. It's called a poof. <laughs> the best part of their room is their view. This window looks out to the backyard. They see the pool and then like in the morning, they just wake up to the trees. And my mom always says there's like blue jays and squirrels. I think that's so cool, but it's really pretty. There's a TV right there, but then also another TV right there. Again, they're still trying to figure out like where they want stuff. So they're gonna take out that one over there in that corner and then keep that one. That's my parents' room, but now we go into the bathroom. Okay, so this is the bathroom that my mom and I use. My mom and I share a Jack and Jill bathroom, so if you don't know what that is, basically just one room right here, bathroom in the middle, and then another room right here. <clears throat> so we just share it. If you're wondering why my dad doesn't use this one, it's just because it's more convenient for him because his workplace is downstairs, so then he can just use the downstairs bathroom. But this is what it looks like. Um, we have our sink area. <laughs> These baskets that we have, just a bunch of stuff that we use on the daily. I have like my skincare fridge. We try to keep this bathroom pretty tidy, but not gonna lie, sometimes it gets pretty messy. But right now it looks really good. <laughs> Over here is the shower. It just looks like that. And that's the bathroom. Last room of the house floor is my room. When you walk in, we have this little bench. I think it's from Amazon, right? Mm -hmm. oh, it's like fluffy. It's very nice. And then above, we have my YouTube plaques, and then also like pictures and some posters. Over here, we have my dresser. TV, just like some decorative stuff. And this is where I keep all of my pajamas, jeans, leggings, stuff like that. We have, I don't know, a bunch of random stuff. Like we have my cowboy hat. <laughs> I'm gonna keep it on for the rest of this video. <laughs> my closet, this is where I have all of my tops. We have my desk area. This is where I do all of my work when I'm doing homework, editing, stuff like that. Makeup drawers. Oh, and then of course we can't forget about my shelves. We have my three shelves for my books. Probably gonna get more because as you can see, they're like overflowing. And then we have my bed. Favorite place in the whole wide world. I can spend the rest of my life here and I would not complain. Over here is my nightstand area. We have a book. I'm currently reading Layla by Coho. Um, this is my photo board. It's supposed to go like here, but I was redoing it a while ago, but I haven't finished it. So I basically just have to print more photos, stick them on there, and then just stick them on the wall. But right now it just kind of looks bare because of that. But that's the whole house. Hope you guys enjoyed the house tour. I'm sorry it took a whole year, but we finally feel like 85% settled in. Of course, we're still gonna be adding stuff and I'll definitely like update you guys with the vlogs on what we've been adding to our house. But I am just so grateful to live here. I love this house so much. And then thanks again to Canon for sponsoring this video. Make sure to click the link down below. Get your Canon EOS M50 Mark II camera. It's like the best camera ever. That's what we're filming. On right now thank you guys for watching i hope you enjoyed make sure to like comment down below subscribe to my channel to my post notifications and go cop some coli merch i will see you guys back with another video i love you guys so so much stay positive bye Mwah! kissing in the front of my car under the stars i want you to know i'll take this love slow